Jennifer. First, let's get into what did you learn this week? I have groundbreaking information today. Wait, what? It is, for me, groundbreaking. It is something I think about all the time. And is this it like is, front page of Reddit? Does everyone know about this? I, or is I, this? I saw it as a big... Uh, a study came out, and it was a news release that I did see on Reddit. It was upvoted a lot, so I think a lot of people relate with this. It's new? It's new. Came Ooh, out recently. Oh, my God. I'm sweating. They found out a way to minimize mosquitoes' interest in you. <laughs> oh, okay. So, and it's also very fascinating. So they realized if you paint stripes oh, I read this. on yeah. you, mosquitoes will be less interested. So they did it on like mannequins of different skin tones. Which, if you look at the photos, is really funny. It's bizarre because yeah. some of them they were laying down, some of them standing up. One interesting tidbit, the ones that were laying down, Females were interested in both standing up and laying down, but only the males would go. Oh, sorry, males would only go after the mannequins that were laying down. Male mosquitoes. Male mosquitoes. So don't lie down. Step one. Well, male mosquitoes aren't the ones who are sucking your blood anyway. Oh, right? true. So true. it's they're, just like they're the big ones that you yeah. see, and you're like, What's that? Um, but so basically, they realized a lot of um, whether it be like modern day indigenous communities or even going back to like Neanderthals, they found paintings and stuff where they paint stripes on them pre the existence of communities wearing clothes. And and now they think that a lot of it has to do with repelling insects. So it's not just mosquitoes. It was all types of insects, or I shouldn't say all types, but a certain category of insects that they were testing. And the mannequins that had the stripes would have, like, significantly less mosquitoes that would ever touch them and because they would get stuck to them. They, like, made That's so them. interesting. Yeah, I thought it was so cool. And they were also like, now they think maybe this is why zebras have stripes. It's wow. a mechanism. Evolutionary to biologists yes. swooped in. Yeah, but there are also other there are also other theories about zebra stripes, as in like it's a type of like dynamic camouflage. So when they're all moving yeah. together, it's actually difficult to oh, see. Oh, like which one's which? Who's who? Oh my god, I'm so confused. Where, yeah, it's like it's like an illusion basically. But it may also be because it protects them against. Into insects. like when we go camping in the summer, you showing up fully <laughs> painted. I will because I get bit by mosquitoes so, so bad. Much. Forever, I've wanted to make a video on mosquitoes. I think Veritasium did, and then I was yeah, like, thank you, because a lot of it does have to do with like the CO2 you breathe out, your body composition position but knowing this that i'm a person who gets a lot of bites i next summer am going to paint myself this in stripes. also <laughs> makes me just think so often about like like the way that we assess like intelligence and science is such a western like an ideology but to think that indigenous people have been doing this for so long like, yeah. and now science is like oh whoa did Maybe you know it's like oh yeah. my god like there's so many different <laughs> right. ways of assessing like literally intelligence and it's like just knowing that like other people have been doing this for so long for a reason right and in 2019 is the first so, so, time like, that even science figured neanderthals it out. <laughs> yeah exactly i just think that's the important like, thing that everyone remember species that you're yeah. like they were so dumb they couldn't even survive well that's not true because i'm reading a lot of neanderthals they were not dumb no i know but that's what people say they're so dumb they oh survive, but yeah then there's elements where you're like they actually had figured shit out yeah i know and i think that that's just something we always need to be reestablishing is that right. science is a framework and then yeah. people who get really pretentious about it right. sometimes are forgetting that there's other ways of assessing intelligence. Mm -hmm.